agency media lists down movies that revolves on the magic hairdressers bring in the storyline. Some focus on how they achieved being the best in the field of hairdressing, while some highlights their important role in bringing the best in a movie character. Number 1. Blow Dry The moment of truth! You have 45 minutes starting now! Ever heard of hairdressing competition? Well, that's the main event in this film, the annual British Hairdressing Championship. Check out how they all try to decide whether they'll join the contest while each characters also contend for their own versions of a happy ending. Number 2. Shampoo Hey, baby. Uh, see a little police? I already said hello. Oh. George, when can we talk? Well, right in the middle of work now. I know, but this is important. I have a decision to make. Inspired by a ludicrous satire 60s lifestyle, this classic film featured a womanizer hairdresser who ends up in a debacle for having way too many lovers. Each of his clients simply can't resist his style and apparent sexual appeal. We have this political thing tonight. Could you come out of the house? Sure. Actually, we went to the bank? Yeah. For long? Yeah. The lead character was based on actual hairdressers Jay Sebring and John Peters. Number 3. Princess Tyrese Your grandmother called. This is the first time she's ever contacted us. What you want? Not necessarily revolving on the story of a hairdresser, but this film shows how important their role is. This film includes a scene with a hairdresser that was pivotal in the transformation of a San Francisco teenager who turned out to be a real-life princess. Because Majesty, only Paolo can take this and this and give you a princess. It was when Mia Thermopolis, played by Anne Hathaway, received a complete makeover that this princess story became even more amusing to teens. Number 4. Good Hair Just yesterday, my daughter came into the house and said, Daddy, how come I don't have good hair? I wonder how she came up with that idea. This 2009 documentary film is about the history and culture of hair among women and men of color. It explores the importance of good hair in a whole race. Have you ever put your hand through a black woman's hair? Hell no! Not a black woman! Hosted by Chris Rock, the entire documentary goes around the world to capture the story of what is the definition of good hair in black culture. Number 5. Barbershop Alright, now listen up. Give me your wallet and your jewelry won't be no problem. Eddie! <laughs> Get your sleeping boys alone! Sit down. The barbershop story follows the life of a barber on the south side of Chicago. Apart from the importance of having the skill to do good haircutting in the business, it also highlights the sentimental value of having a business being passed on from family. The bank is going to foreclose on the shop. I made your father the same offer, but you're a better businessman. You got vision. A little trivia, the cast spent a month training at a barber college to prepare for their roles. Only actor Troy Garrity had had previous hair cutting experience. Number 6. Hair Show What if your own sister is your very own competitor in the industry of hairdressing? This film gives emphasis on the value of family over anything in the world. What you think? Wow, Peaches, this is amazing. <laughs> I am so glad you like it. Now, I added a couple tracks in it to give it fullness and flair. Excuse me. What in the hell is going on here? Oh, Zora, don't be mad. Peaches was just trying to help. Check out how two sisters who are rivals in the business join forces to win a competition with a lucrative cash prize to prove their worth in LA. Number 7, Beauty Shop. It's all that. And we make it all happen here at the beauty shop. And I'm not just talking about making you look fly. In here, we share everything. If you are a hairdresser who is planning to set out the path in owning your own beauty shop, then this film is for you. Ask yourself, are you ready to walk through these doors? You ready to hear what I hear? The beauty shop revolves on the story of a talented hairdresser who finally took her shot to own her own beauty shop. Number 8. Nora's Hair Salon. Go do Tony. She needed a touch-up. Tony, who the hell is that? 
Braxton Paul. Hair salons play an important role in bringing people together in a community. In this comedic film, Nora's hair salon serves as the go-to place of people for friendship and family. I love him! What do you know about love? You still got Similac on your breath. Check out some sassy and eccentric hairstyles from this film. Number 9. Mansum. This is just how a human male looks. I can get rid of this beard in a second. If you're into knowing the real deal in the hair business, then you should watch this documentary film. Mansum explores the question of what does it mean to be a man in an era where grooming products are a hit. Number 10. The Big Teeth. Welcome to Los Angeles. What kind of movie are you guys making? It's exactly like Braveheart, except it's a hairdressing movie set in modern times. Most of it is indoors and nobody gets killed. This 1999 documentary shows the thrilling adventure of a flamboyant Glasgow hairdresser, Crawford Mackenzie, who gets invited for the World Hairdresser International Federation's prestigious annual contest. Many great hairdressing movies in Hollywood history. Shampoo. The twist? After maxing his credit card, he finds out that he was invited not to compete, but just as an audience. Check out his journey of getting into the competition and representing the little people. Fun fact, the hair pieces used in the final Platinum Scissors competition are made from real human hair. Acrylic, which is normally used in wigs, doesn't photograph well and ends up looking like plastic. Each hairpiece weighed about four pounds.